they who came to us with a complaint of recurrent transit ischemic attack on the right cerebral circulation. A Doppler was done which showed uh, critical stenosis of the right AC origin and subsequently we did a DSA which is demonstrating uh, there is a 99% stenosis of the right IC origin. So we are going to do a carotid artery stenting with distal embolic protection in this patient today which will prevent uh, subsequent TIA and a stroke. This is the right common carotid artery angiogram which is uh, demonstrating a critical stenosis of the right IC origin over here and this needs to be stented which we are going to do today. Distal embolic protection. This is the distal embolic protection here. This is the NAP6. We can see the filter basically. And uh, this filter we are just pushing it uh, it's about the petrous ICA. So during the staining of the cervical ICA if there is any clot goes on this this umbrella, this filter is going to protect that. So this is how the filter looks like. This is the right common carotid artery angiogram which is uh, demonstrating a critical stenosis of the right IC origin over here and this needs to be stented which we are going to do today. So here we, we are trying to gently navigate uh, the wire of the NAV6 of so the distal embolic protection uh, through the critical stenosis and uh, once we go across the lesion with the wire then we can push the filter over the wire and we would like to place it over the petrous ICA. Yes, uh, we are successful in getting across the lesion. Now we will push the filter over that. So I'm just trying to take the NAV6 and my idea will be to keep it on a straight segment at the petrous ICA and this filter is going to protect any kind of uh, distal embolus that is going across. Uh, during the standing and uh, it will just hold it so that we can just bring it back which will prevent a stroke during uh, the procedure. So we are deploying the, basically the filter that can be nicely deployed over here. So this is what it looks like. The dyslamolic protection is uh, across the lesion in the petrous ICA. And we are ready to go ahead with the stenting. We'll go with the primary stenting if required. Uh, post angioplasty uh, will be planned. So this is how it looks like. Uh, this is a stent. And uh, this so we can see this uh, very good flow into the cerebral circulation through the stent. Uh, this is a post stent picture which is showing a very good, extremely good flow across the stent without any residual lesion and uh, the flow is going all the way across into the brain and this is the, basically the AP view, the lateral view and this is brain circulation which looks fantastically well and then we come back and we take the AP view which is uh, beautiful without any residual stenosis whatsoever